What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. So today I decided to hop on Yukon Valley and uh, I'm gonna go after some uh, caribou. So I'm gonna go out and uh, check out some spots. So hopefully I get out here and uh, find something decent. So I'll catch you guys later when I find uh, a decent sized caribou. Alright guys, so I'll show you where I am on the map. So when I did my intro, I spawned in this outpost, worked my way down. I placed a tent about 200 yards from this zone, and I just placed two tripods. So one's on the left side of the uh, train bridge, and one's on the right, depends how you look at it. Now I just bought out a new zone for uh, caribou. Now I'm just going to verify him on the map. Okay, so he's about 270. Oh, I got one right here. Okay, that's a three. I got the 30 odd six. I'm not too sure. If I go for this guy, this guy's probably going to hear the shot, so I'm not going to risk it. I'm just going to go for the big one for now. And that shot looked high. And he's down. Probably not going to get another shot. I don't know how that did not register to him. And these guys are leaving the scene. Alright guys, I am now in the other tripod. And these guys are nervous, obviously. Got a bunch of caribou. That's not a bad four. I think when that four steps out, I'm going to take him down. Wait, was that him or was that another one? That's a very nice caribou. I think that was the one that I did spot. Is he going to stop? He's going to pile up. So did the three. Alright guys, I did spot out another Caribou, he's about 300 yards. Did that connect with the lung? I'm gonna say it didn't, his health is not dropping. Alright guys, so I came to the uh, first caribou that I took a shot. Now I did see vital blood on the ground, which is there, so that's definitely vital blood. Now I just spotted out a new zone for caribou. I got another level 4, so I'm gonna go ahead and take him down. And that was solid. Is he going to pile up in the water? Which he did. <clears throat> Alright, let's pick up our first caribou. So, 279 yards. Got a double lung on a light brown fur type. I'd say that's a pretty uh, centered shot. Scoring 349. Whoa, hello. Okay, that must have been the three that was with that four. I'm not going to waste them. He's down. All right, here's our floater, 157 yards, got a right lung and liver. All right, guys, here's the level three that almost ran me down. 
Ooh, got a lucky shot on that, and I guess the second shot didn't actually connect with him. But 95 yards, and I pulled off a stomach and liver. Alright guys, I got back into the other tripod, and I still have the other two caribou piled up here, but I've been sending out some calls. I want to try to take one of these guys down with the 243. That's a vital. Now it is probably going to take a while for his health to drop. Probably got a single lung on that. Alright guys, in the meantime, let's pick up these two. Double lung at 106 yards. Level 4. It's going 333. So he's quite the ways off for being a uh, a diamond, but uh, that's not a bad looking uh, level 4. Well, there is a lot of caribou here. Uh, that's definitely a female. Uh, that's a male, that's a small one. Shouldn't have too much hunting pressure here. I've been using the tripod. Of course, when I'm about to take a shot, they're never facing me. And there's another level three. Oh, I think I messed up that heart shot. But he's gonna pile up. Alright, also 106 yards, got a double lung on this guy. That shot was a little high. Alright guys, here's the one that I just took a shot at. Yeah, w not quite that heart shot, but got a right lung at 119. Alright guys, so here's the one that I took down with the 243. So 30 yards out, butts it through the shoulder blade, got the left lung. Well, there's no way I track them uh, 0.54 miles. Because my tripod is right there about 260 yards roughly, 250. So he didn't run all that far really from where I took the shot. Alright guys, so I changed uh, locations. So I'll show you where I am on the map. So this is where I started. Took a few down there. Now I already had a setup up here. Um, I think my tent is a little too close for this zone here. So I think I'm gonna have to move it because it's, it's too close to the zone so they're not gonna be rendered in. But in the meantime, I got a few out here. Those are all female. I got a level three there. Is it just me or... That fur definitely looks different. Okay, I'm definitely gonna take him down just to uh, be sure that it's not a rare fur type. I could be wrong on that. It's probably just the way he's in the shade. I got another herd over here. But these are a bunch of females. And then I looked around the lake. Spotted a new zone. And then I got another guy right here. And that's pretty much it around the lake. But yeah, like I said, this guy here... I think it's just because the tr branch is in the way, so he's probably just an ordinary fur type. Uh, 
Okay, yeah, he doesn't look, uh, uh, another one piled up in the water. Alright, let's go for this other guy. He's closer. Just gonna verify the range. Okay, he's actually uh, a lot further than I thought. His health is dropping. I'm going to say that's a single lung. Alright guys, I'm going to try to go for a 400 yard shot. Shot connected. His health is dropping. We might as well take the other one down if he sticks around. Oh, no way. I dropped him. Alright guys, let's see if I can grab him. Oh, I guess he's a little too far out. Got him. Uh, double long at 233 yards. Okay, he's a light brown fur type. It's just because the way the shade was and... He was actually behind a branch, so it looked kind of different. Alright guys, I've been working my way around the lake, and I got a warning call from behind me. So that's what I mentioned about before, that I'm going to have to move my tent. Because now I do have a caribou where my tripod is. And he's about 280. I did connect with the lung, he's going down. Alright guys, here's another one. So this guy here got a right lung at 372 yards. Alright guys, so this is the one that dropped on the spot. Now I do see a lot of blood on the ground, so that's a really good sign. So let's pick him up. 410 yards. But, got the right lung and heart. That's quite the shot. Alright, let's pick him up. This guy was further out. Uh, 435 yards. Got a left lung. Alright guys, here's the last one at this lake, so let's pick him up. Uh, got a left lung at 266. Now I don't know what it is with these level 4s, and they, I find the reindeer are similar. You get a lot of level 4s, and they're only a silver. Alright guys. So, I had to back up the time, and I decided to come back, well, come back, I decided to come check out this lake here. I already had some zones for uh, caribou. Well, I think I got some coming back in here, into this, into this zone. I did spook these guys off before. Uh, two females so far. I had a bad win when I was coming to this spot here, but anyways, I got a f level 4 there, got a 3, I got another level 4, about 400 yards out, got another level 4, that one's definitely smaller. This guy here has a really good estimate on him, but they're far enough out that they're not even going to hear the gunshot. So let's go for this guy first. He's going down. Don't want to create too much hunting pressure, so I'm just going to take down the bigger ones. Oh yeah, this guy is definitely, you can even tell at a distance. So I'm just going to verify him on the map. 
Okay, it's about 380, almost 390. I'm just gonna lay down on this shot. I'm gonna say that's a single lung. Alright guys, let's pick this one up. Got a right lung at 266 yards. Alright guys, here's the other level 4. So let's go ahead and pick them up. So 388 yards. Got a right lung. Alright guys, so I had a setup here before as well, now I didn't have any zones until I spotted out this one, so the caribou still come to this area, so I just spotted out this first zone, and I do have a level 4, I think I'm going to take him down, I think he's the only male to be honest. Okay, he's gonna get alert, so let's, uh... He's gonna pile up. Alright folks, I guess he wasn't the only male, if I'm gonna get a shot on him. Don't know how well this is gonna work out. Ah, uh, the female- oh, I did get a shot on him. And I ended up shooting that female. Wait, did he just pile up? Alright, here's the first caribou at this lake. Double long at 98 yards. And yet again, another level 4 scoring silver. Alright, let's pick up this guy. 141 yards, got a stomach, liver, and right lung. Alright guys, I've been working my way around. So I did spot out two zones here. Another zone here. I just spotted out these three zones. Uh, what did I see him? That's a three. Okay, there's another four. 160 yards out. And I do have some more here. Got a four there, and I got another four there. That's gonna take him down. These guys are gonna flee. I'm pretty sure this guy is a bit further out. Uh, 316. I think I messed up on that shot. Definitely got that guy. Smoke them. And we'll take a fox down while we're at it. Definitely vital blood. Got a left lung at 61 yards. Uh, I believe this caribou is not too far. His health was dropping pretty quick. Alright, 
let's pick them up. Uh, got a stomach, right lung, and liver at 99 yards. Alright, let's pick up this guy. Busted through the shoulder blade, got a right lung at 161. Alright guys, this should be the last one around the lake that I took a shot at. Got a shoulder blade and left lung at almost 300 yards. Well folks, on that note, I think that's going to be a wrap for this clip. So hopefully you, you guys all enjoyed uh, me taking down some caribou. Like I've said in my previous uh, videos, I uh, like changing changing it up a bit and uh, using different calibers and hunting different species so like I said that's going to be a wrap so for those that watch my videos I really appreciate it like and subscribe and I'll catch you guys all next time